Welcome to Access to Experts on Location. I'm Dick Heatherton, and I'm with Yannick Silver. Let's talk about uh, in marketing, online marketing, what are some of the biggest mistakes you have found most people make? Yeah, absolutely. There's, there's definitely some big ones. Uh, one of the biggest is when I work with, with students and clients, they, uh, they, they want to get, they have this idea that they're going to have maybe 10 websites and each of them want, are going to do $1,000 a month. So they're like, well, that's great, $10,000 a month, you know, that's $120,000 a year, uh, you know, I'll be on easy street. And you know what happens, Dick, is they don't get any of them done. They're all in various states of incompletion. So the biggest mistake is, is that lack of focus. So if they can just focus in on, on one thing, then they get the, the system, the model right, and then it becomes a cookie cutter, just like what I've done in building up dozens and dozens of websites that way, but, but not starting off that way. What would you say are probably the, the most important questions a person needs to ask when getting going? I usually focus a couple things. One is, what do you really like to do? Uh -huh. And uh, we all get to set the rules. We get to make it up as, as we go. And there's no point in, especially online, there's, you can find marketplaces that are so tiny and unique that are into pretty much whatever you're into. Um, I have a student of mine who sells, who teaches people how to take an engine out of a, a Honda Civic and put it into a Honda Accord so it'll go faster. You know, that's a weird, tiny little group of people who want to make Very their Honda Accords go faster. And he's making six figures after I helped him. So I really, I want people to hone in on what do they really love and enjoy. People have heard, you know, do what you love, the money will follow. And that may or may not be true, but there's got to be a marketplace for, for what you love. Uh, but, but start with that. Start with your interest, what's exciting to you, what really gets you, what gets you going. And then you can turn that into a business and many times online. Uh, what I specialize in is teaching people how to take their expertise or content and then sell it. And, and most of us don't think that we have that, but we do, you do. Was there any one instance or maybe one person that really propelled you to where you are today? There's several. I mean, probably a, a lot. Like what? Uh, like who? Probably my, the first, uh, I guess, mentor or person that I've really helped get me going, I would have to say is my father. Uh, we, uh, my family came over from Russia in 1976 when I was two and a half, and a Russian immigrant family and typical immigrant success story. Started with uh, $256 in his pocket, came over, didn't really know the language, and uh, for my mom, his mom, or sorry, her mom and, and myself, and um, he started his own business about a year after we got here. And, and what uh, business was that? Medical equipment sales mm -hmm. and service, and so I, I got to experience that entrepreneurship that that creating, taking an idea from nothing and turning it into money from scratch. And, uh, and so that was a tremendous influence on me. Um, and you know, I've had many other mentors along the way that people like uh, Dan Kennedy as far as marketing, um, people like Earl Nightingale as far as self-development. There's been you know, countless people. I, I try and spend, I try and read at least one book a week and uh, I really think that, that your life is influenced by the books you read and the people you meet and the things that you do. Is there any instance that you can recall where you'd say, if only I knew then what I know now? Sure, <laughs> lots of times. Okay, like what? What's, what's the one thing that really comes to mind? Uh, one of the biggest things is um, not having something right after the sale for that customer. So, you know, we're all happy, we make the sale, we got, we got the, the money coming in our bank account. But I've learned that now you can set up ways where you can uh, create ongoing continuity. You can, you can get recurring revenue from those exact same customers who are willing to pay one time when they'll pay multiple times for, for your products and services if you put them on a monthly something. And um, so I've done that recently, but uh, I don't. I can't even count the uh, the amount of money that I've probably missed by not doing that, by by not having them automatically, either sign up or ask to be part of a monthly service product, something like that. Yannick Silver, I want to thank you so much for joining us on Access to Experts Thanks and Location. To. And if people wanted to learn a little bit more about what you have to offer, how can they do so online? <laughs> yeah, definitely online. Uh, probably the best spot is uh, Internet Lifestyle. Dot com is my blog where I talk about fun, freedom, financial independence. 
Um, I also have a brand new business that I'm really excited about called oh. Maverick Business Adventures, uh -huh. where we take uh, CEOs, entrepreneurs, and uh, business owners out on these once-in-a-lifetime trips, uh, combine it with business building and networking. And uh, there's also a charitable aspect to it, and uh, that's at maverickbusinessadventures.com. Yannick Silver, thank you so Thanks, much for Dave. joining us on Access to Experts on Location. Mm -hmm.